Hi everyone, so this is my video journal of No Impact Week Day 1, which is the No Consumption Day. And when I read about this day and prepared myself, I thought, no big deal, no consumption, that means not buying any new things. Um, which can, you know, you can do that for a week. You can not buy something new for a week. But rather than just try to put off all my purchases until next week, um, I'm trying to reevaluate how I can make the purchases that I need to make on a regular basis in a more friendly way. So um, one thing that I'm going to explore over the course of this week is makeup. Um, I need some new makeup soon. And besides just using resources to get the makeup, then you have trash left over. So, um, you know, what can you do? So I, I'm going to be exploring that and I'll get back to you on that. I've also made a commitment not to use any new paper. So whatever writing I need to do, I'm going to use scrap paper because I have plenty of it. Um, I'm not going to use any tissue paper or any other forms of um, paper except for toilet paper. And um, <laughs> I'm going to try to participate in the secondhand economy um, by donating some clothing to uh, a local charity or to people that really need new clothing. And by using a swap tree where you can swap DVDs. And, um, you know, something that they said at the meeting today really... Um, made an impact on me. We met with Colin Beaven, No Impact Man, and the rest of the New Yorkers participating in this. And, you know, Colin pointed out that a lot of people use cars because they feel like it's the most convenient way to get around. But the typical um, person in LA has to spend about seven weeks of their working year paying for all the fees associated with their car and, you know, owning the car and the gas and everything. And then on top of that, in LA, the average person spends two weeks per year in traffic. So the average person in LA is spending nine weeks of their year devoted to having a car. So that's just a really, um, that was a really poignant example to me of this, um, the norm, you know, that we accept as being the way to go as maybe not being the best option out there. So I'm really looking forward to exploring more of this stuff and I'll let you know what I find out about makeup and how it goes to not consume anything. Um, Today I've been okay on that, but I am going to have to make some purchases later in the week. So I will keep you informed and stay tuned for my next post tomorrow, Monday, day two of the No Impact Week experiment. Thanks.